Of course the song stops there because I never got around to finishing it two years ago. The wrong one. <laughs> Let's go to the usual radio. One that gets me a bunch of copyright strikes on YouTube. Well, I guess they aren't strikes, just kind of claims. You know, the usual. Hello. And how are you doing today? Hello. Answering sleep mode. Maybe nice weather we are having. Do you agree with this statement? They are tradable. wonder if I should take the jetpack on or like just keep the spider monkey stuff or I could just not have a backpack on at all yeah I think that's good Hello. Hi. well time to do what I usually do some Don Doom farming and while I'm waiting at Don Doom I'll play like Fallout or something. Seems like it might be a little fun. Catch you later. <laughs> like familiar? Same time it isn't. It's just because so many people start their names with Queen. Let me know. I'll turn it down immediately. jumpy. Bye -bye. Can't wait to do this at level 36. <laughs> Actually, you know what, I think that music might be actually a bit too loud. Okay, better.
Rates do I have? Yes, yeah. Ready crates. Full of crate. Melee enemies are the best to fight because they don't damage you. For these guys, like as soon as you attack them, they launch an attack. Hey, you. Realized my shooting is matching up to the beat of this song. Heal is probably the best nano power. when you get the spawns just right. It's hilarious because they're named Toxic Spawns too. Just keep farming for a little bit. Just to get a bit more extra money on my way.
Auto run. <sighs> so it's been about, what, six minutes? I feel like Eddie should be the one with the extra money. Very nice weather we are having today. Do you agree with the statement? I didn't I barely had any yesterday. I had like half a bottle. <laughs> Hopefully my throat doesn't hurt me as much later tonight. I realize I could be taken out of context. That would be hilarious. Young Napoleon. Save you. I should have clipped that guy asserting his dominance. Ah, that would have been hilarious. Right. Yeah, that song's gonna be loud, isn't it? I guess what I love most about our nurse isn't just one thing. That's better. But anyway, over here, there was a guy uh, doing a T pose. The motor raptor was just staring directly at him. I'm no longer going for eggs right now. I'm just going to try and get 100k. <laughs> That's my goal for this stream. Get 100k, then buy an inventory full of eggs. Where did I get that? Just Are they following me? Uh, I should pay attention to chat more. You know what? It would be a really good idea if I went in my settings and changed chat color. Once I get 100k and open all those eggs, I'll do Dundoon and Fallout 4. Look to the future. Yes. Chubby Simmy Fang. Julius Saturn Gravitas.
That's not Julius. No, it is Julius. Wow, the kerning on that made it look like it was just three U's. shirts and stuff didn't look so like blank like every shirt was designed to have a backpack on it or something hey Ellie cat how you doing I'm doing pretty good. I'm gonna try to get a hundred thousand taros this stream. Yeah. There's only like two or three people in my shard right now. Which is nice. Well, in this like specific zone, I guess I should say. Well, a bunch more just popped in. See that immediately it's populated. like I oh what are they doing are they just doing the platforming bit are they racing like by themselves odd because if people wanted to do the head of Larry 3000 they'd just take the cannon right maybe they don't know about that ah hints. Uh, honestly I cannot wait until racing is a thing because I feel like racing would be a lot more entertaining to watch than just what I'm doing. And if I was racing, people could, you know, study my route and stuff, see what I'm doing and build upon that. We'd have like a speedrunning community, like how they usually form. We might even get our own, like, uh, what's it called, category on speedrun.com. infected zone races like a drop down menu with all 36 infected zones is there 36 i don't know there might be less honestly it might be based on score and speed too Well, I don't know is that there's, there's barely any racing videos on YouTube. The ones I did watch, like, were for the Billy and Mandy factory or whatever. Innsville. Is it Innsville? No, it's not Innsville. It's, uh, wherever they are. Oh, well. I feel like people are following me around. Ah. This guy spawns just to get stuck on that, like, little random staircase going over nothing. Pretty funny. So I think this guy might get stuck right here. Full of crates again. Ugh.
Yeah, I'll, I'll notice when I'm full of crates. It makes a noise as well. Like, boom. Since I'm going for money, I'm going to open them all and sell them. Seen the latest dev vlog where Devin was talking about uh, how they might be able to keep this up indefinitely, or was that another thing? Hello. Yeah, I've seen it. Then. Ooh, I, I actually wonder if they can keep it up indefinitely. That would be really nice. And unopened crates. Oh man. How many gumballs? Hello. And how are you doing today? Hello. All right, that's 10k at uh, 15 minutes or so. Pretty fast. Hello. Bye. Yeah. <laughs> Technically 11%. <laughs> Thank you. I'll, I'll read it when I'm done streaming. Maybe I'll read it while I'm doing, while I'm waiting for Don Doom. <laughs> I don't think you're supposed to be able to just jump over that. Yeah. They said they might update it later. So maybe I can just read it again as an excuse to check for updates. I feel like the future is about to be split up into two categories. People who wear toasty shirts or Mach 5 shirts. <laughs> Alrighty. May your operating system boot fast. Toxic spawns. These are probably the enemy I've killed the most of. Hey, Joe, how's it going? Ah. Gonna fix it tonight? I hope you can fix your sleeping schedule. It seems like no matter how try how hard I try to get a day sleeping schedule, it just resets back to what I've got going now, where I go to sleep at 6 in the morning. And it's odd, like, this is like the only sleeping schedule I can consistently keep. Yeah. So I've actually got some pretty good news. 
I am super close to getting a subscriber button and being able to accept bits. I think in just about two or three more streams where I have more than three average viewers, then that'll get me affiliate. And I'm super excited about that. Because honestly, I've had the other options for affiliate ticked off for months and months now. I just couldn't get the viewers. But it's not like I stream, you know, strictly for having high view counts. I stream so people can watch me. And maybe learn a thing or two about the games I play. So I will say having a lot of people participate in my chat is really fun. It gives me something to focus on other than just the game itself. Little monkey speed. Good old chill out. When do I think Retro will fully come out? I'm gonna say... Spring 2019. That's my guess. I'm, I'm sure, like, more sneak peeks will come out before then, too. Yeah. I honestly think what they have going now, right now, just this sneak peek, is amazing by itself. Uh, no, I don't think the past will be in the next sneak peek, but I could be wrong. I think the next sneak peek might be working on... I mean, this is not like an official word of mouth or whatever. It's just what I think. I don't think people should take, you know, literally. I just think the next sneak peek will probably focus on social features more than, you know, the past. And then, like, there'll be a third one, then the full game will come out. Then we'll have Legacy to look forward to in some time, like, far, far in the future. Heck, maybe Legacy will have a demo. Monsters that outrange me. I heard about a legacy demo. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'd like to think, I'd like to just forget about that entirely. Uh, but at least they replaced it with the full, the entirety of the old game itself. <laughs> so we got that going for us. Yeah, middle school. Yep. Yeah. I'm sure progress will speed up from here. Because people actually have something to, you know, not complain about as much, you know? Like, I'm sure there's still the forum's fair share of people who whine about stuff that is on their end. You know, I'm not trying to diss people or anything. But yeah. Like, I've seen a lot of threads get locked immediately. 
surprisingly, it's starting to slow down, like, the amount of garbage there is. Ooh, yeah, it got really bad, like, around the 6th. Uh, there were so many people just making accounts just to troll. And at some point, Prissy's Discord itself got trolled as well. People were sending cars porn. <laughs> In the in the general. <laughs> uh spooky. Had to ping a mod. I know. Race to it. Two more slots. Actually, I think I remember the exact. Yeah, it was Stevie. I think I pinged Stevie to come help out in the general, and he like immediately cleaned it up. Good on you, Stevie. You're an excellent mod and community team member. Honestly, I think all the CTs and mods and games are amazing. Well, except maybe a few of them, but I won't name names. I use a few sparingly, as in, like, maybe two people. <laughs> okay, maybe I don't dislike them, I just don't think they're as good as the rest. They're still good. I should put it that way. I think at some point they started locking I Quit Giving Up threads. Or whatever like that, because there were so many duplicates. They're like duplicate thread locking. Then people started getting mad at the mods for locking the thread. Wait, that's what for forums are meant to be searched for things that already are, you know, active. Like if there's a topic you can Hey it's Alley Cat, welcome back, man. Alley cat, 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 cat is back, back, back. Yeah, but Forums are supposed to be used sparingly, and, well, sparingly, I mean by, like, yeah, the hissy fits are pretty bad, especially when they're posted by people who just make the account. Like, they actually just want to get a reaction from I saw that so many times. But what I'm talking about forums is they're meant to be searched first, and then you post your topic afterwards. Because if there's a topic like that isn't you know completely dead and irrelevant videos uh if there's a topic that isn't completely dead and irrelevant it's okay to bring it back to the front page again to talk about it you know at least that's how i understand the rules and stuff but having a million threads get posted of video you don't bump the guy Mojo or something? Uh. Uh. Honestly, I think the the moderators, the community team, have done an excellent job cleaning up the forums and stuff and keeping them clean. Ah, I need to open the first. Rates open. Hello. And how are you doing that? Ah. Yeah, I still browse the forums every now and then just to look at all the threads and lurk around. So it's, it probably isn't that healthy for me. <laughs> uh, 
I feel like if I were on the community team, I'd be pretty active. But like at the same time, I would, I would not like being on the community. I doubt they would accept me. Anyway, because I have no experience with that kind of thing. Even though I'm constantly looking at things, constantly lurking, stuff like that. That's probably not what they're looking for. They're looking for like people skills and stuff. Oh man, there were there are so many people in Frizzy's chat sometimes with that I'll just like say they'll ask the same questions over and over again in caps. And that kinda grates my nerves. Yeah. I think they are were I think when they put out those applications they were looking more for programmers instead of like, you know, forum moderators and stuff. And at some point I'm pretty sure so, I've disconnected, I think. Nope, never mind. Everybody just sat still. <laughs> so, yeah, I think they were mainly looking for more programmers, because I'm sure I heard one of the devs or something on a stream complain about how Fusionfall had no coders in it when the DM went down. <laughs> Meanwhile, like, Toontown had a million that immediately revived it. And most of the coders for this game haven't even played the original. At least that's, that's what I heard. That's not, like, completely true. Maybe exaggerating the truth a little bit. Uh, I need water. I just drank an entire bottle. I can't open the bottle. I'm so weak. <laughs> ah, that's better. I am hydrated. I need that stay hydrated bot. It'd be pretty fun. I just tried to relate crate dropping to like a three a three headed coin flip <laughs> and I realized that wouldn't really work very well. going to buy so many eggs when I get a hundred thousand taros. What is going on in this song? <laughs> Just hear ding 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 German. And I think maybe somebody getting pummeled. Ah, uh, you know, that people always people are talking about like the mission drought at level twenty nine, and I never really experienced that, and I'm not sure why. The only mi oh, I got stuck. The only real mission drought I experienced was like at level thirty five, where I had to deal or had to do every single guide mission and skill. Still didn't get level 36. So I sat there grinding at Green Maw for a long, long time. It was worth it though, I got a bunch of cannonball items. By that I mean like just the pants. I know the shirt was level 34, pants 35. Wait, no, the boots were 35, the pants were 36. I remember, I remember now. <laughs> Never explored. Like, I'm pretty sure at, I, I, I'm pretty sure some people might have gotten stuck in the city and not known where to go. Like level 15 and such. That must have happened.
Yeah. Honestly, the future has been a new experience for me, because I did the future before they removed all those missions. Like, I was really surprised when I saw Mandar get uh, Peach Creek Estates. And I've, I gotta say, though, I don't like the new streamlined missions and stuff. Because I think the future should have more content. Should have had more content. But for some reason they got rid of the subscriptions and didn't want to keep people in the future. And I'm talking about the old old uh, old CN devs, not the not the latest one. They had nothing to do. They did amazing. Latest devs, Will Mayhem, all them, they did amazing. Um Oh, uh, man. I think for the entirety of the Academy, I was just on my level 36 character grinding around... Grinding around um, Lord Fuse's lair. Well, sometimes I, I came to Lord to Mount Blackhead to sell stuff. And who knows, maybe I saw Ty Aquazon floating around in the air. <laughs> I do remember hanging out in the catacombs a lot as well. I don't know why I like that place so much. I just liked uh, glitching up onto the walls and looking at it like the abyss. <laughs> it was super cool. Hey Aquafina, thanks for stopping by tonight. The armor you get was level four. Five or four. Dawn Doom set is level four. And um currently the only armor I've gotten from Dawn Doom are the pants. <laughs> I've gotten four pairs of pants. Uh but yes, Dawn Doom Dawn Doom set is level four. The Slayer pants, Slayer set and the Bad Max set are level five, so you have to crockpot them to something. But these weapons from Dawn Doom are level four as well. Yeah, I, I'm probably going to play and stream the demo as much as I can up until Friday just to get, you know, as much raw footage as I can to maybe help out with bug testing and stuff. Yeah, Friday. That's, that's when they're going to, you know, try and see what's going on with the server. At least that's when I've heard they're going to shut down the sneak peek. Technically, Aquafina, those are the two same things, and they're exactly where I'm farming them at. But yeah, I think they're going to keep this sneak peek going until Friday, and then we'll get like an announcement whether they're going to make or break it or keep it going, you know? That's what I think. And I use make and break as like a sort of... What's the word? Yeah, I hope it stays too. Super late, super early. 3 a.m. at 3. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> See you in a bit, Joe.
Uh, one more crates. All right. Three more crates. I have a full inventory and I can go sell them and I gotta go right back to farming in Toxic Spawns. Ha ha ha. Uh, I really wish bunny hopping was a thing in this game. Who knows, maybe that'll be a thing in Legacy. Legacy is the complete wild card. I have no idea what they're going to add to it. Fill in my Discord if you want to join. Alright, sure. Sure thing. Hey, man. Yo, yo. What's going on? Farm and toxic spawns. <laughs> Anyway, how's your night been? It's been pretty eventful. Been packing all day. Yeah. Uh, and went out to dinner. And then came back and... What'd you have for dinner? Packed some more. I had some sushi, actually. Sushi? Mm -hmm. I want to try sushi sometime in my life. I'm a real picky person, but I love sushi. Yeah. Fish is good. I like fish. <laughs> mm -hmm. I'm a big seafood person. I'll eat pretty much any kind of seafood. Long John Silver's has really good breading. They do. Got all these people once I spawned in uh, by Don Doom. They're just sitting here chilling, and everybody's asking about a time. Yeah. And nobody's got one, so. <laughs> Oof. You know it's because people with the timers are out farming or something, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Definitely. Hello. It's gotta be. I'm, I just don't want to leave because I know the second one of them shows up, oh, they'll be here. Oh, and I'm not here, I'll miss it. So, I'm trying not to miss it. Yep. Oh, cool, I got the air, um, the airbrush blaster. I like that for the mogging purposes of it all. Make it look different. New follower. See, I'm too slick for you. Is now following. Thank you, man. I appreciate that. Uh oh, look who's in the chat. Hey, it's Ronan. Hey, man. How's your night been? Thanks for stopping by. I saw you earlier today. Uh, hanging out with Magical Dealer. Recently you realized how much of a big nerd you've been. Ah. Happens to the best of us, we're all nerds and inside. I think I might have been playing games since like... Uh, okay, let's see. Since I was three, maybe. So, yeah. arguably, I was not very good. I raised 20% to, um, 100k. Nice. Hey, booties. Oh, yeah. oh, looks like... Wait, what? How's my night going? Uh, I am working on getting 100,000 Taros, because I have nothing else to do. Do you know the timer on your shard? On my shard? Don Doom and stuff? Uh, no, I don't usually get them as soon as I log in. I just want to go farm. Since, mm -hmm. you know, it's it's really crowded when I start playing. Yeah. Like around midnight. Have you found out, uh, whenever you go back to sell everything you opened up from your crates, find out if the guns and stuff sell for more Toros. I feel like they would. Uh, things are around 50 to 75 Taros. I can take, I can look at the exact values if you want. 
Yeah, because I've got I keep hoping to put a bunch of weapons and I feel like those are in most MMOs and stuff they're normally worth more to sell than armor. Yeah. So I'm wondering. I know gumballs are only ten taros and that kind of made me disappointed. Sad face. I remember you talking about that last night, that was depressing. Yeah. That means selling 20 taros would be like 200 taros. Mm -hmm. Or 20 gumballs. Yeah, it's unfortunate because Don Doom and Bad Max are pretty much the only end game content. And people want to make this game last, at like, even though it's a sneak peek, they want to make it last. So they're hanging out around there to try and get, you know, a chance at the loot. And I'm sure some of the devs will spawn more to make up for there not being groups. Like a certain unnamed dev did. And I got uh, four pairs of the same pants. <laughs> gonna lord that over this game forever <laughs> so what did you do during the sneak peek well i just farmed out don doom and got those same four sets of pants every single time absolutely <laughs> <laughs> i also got an inventory full of blindfolds haha <laughs> oh yeah you're working on i got my first blindfold today earlier i was so happy hey earlier today i was uh in Rez's chat with Prisified, mm -hmm. and um, he said he was farming blindfolds on another monitor while watching Rez. <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. Is that what you're gonna go for? Is <laughs> inventory full of blindfolds with the eggs? Absolutely. It's gonna be so frustrating when like my inventory is actually like full of blindfolds except for like two spots. <laughs> Ugh. I'll just have to forego getting crates all together. Just focus on the money. Yeah. I think the whole idea of uh, the fact that this is all that's in the game for right now, for the sneak peek, is just so people get the feel for the game. Maybe for people who uh, haven't played in a long time, all this other stuff. Yeah. Also, they're only putting out for, what is it, like five days, I think was the, is the total so far? Is it for all the way up to Friday is the last day? so far so it's cool, been cool. like a sneak peek week yeah so i, I think wish, that's what they're aiming for currently wish bad max and don doom were harder to kill and the respawn rate down to 30. yeah oh, when yeah. this when this first came out the sneak peek um i think somebody was tossing around some false information that they had changed the bad max rate or don doom rate to 30 minutes mm. but that was false because i i immediately disproved that <laughs> With a timer, a well placed 30 minute timer. I want to know how to get this one cape that's right here. It's like just a plain cape. The Dracula cape or? No, it's not the Dracula one and it's not the spooky one that I have on. Is and it... I see the superhero one. Is it like still a reddish cape? No, it's kind of purple. It's like a dark purple, almost black. It might be black, it just depends on the shading, I think, but I think Is it's Is the superhero cape? No, uh, that's kind of a navy blue with the yellow in it, right? The spooky cape? Or are you thinking about The spooky or... one's all purple, I'm wearing that one. This one has a hood on it, but the what? hood's not on your character. A hood? Yeah, and it's, it's got like a hood that's just sitting on your back. Are you looking at a dev or a CT member team? I see somebody named Dante the Unknown. They're not known as anything. I'm about to ask them, actually. Yeah. It might be something... Actually, you know what? I could just look on the wiki. Backpacks. Here. Is it the long cloak? He says it's from the golden egg. It's probably the long cloak then. Yeah. Is it a super rare? Oh, it's just like a uncommon. Oh, I'm sure people only get the super duper eggs because they just want a shot at the rare loot. They just say it's from the super duper egg. In reality, mm -hmm. they're just from eggs. Yeah. 
just the chances of getting them are better from the super duper one. I'm thinking about buying a bunch of the low ones just to see what the chances are or what the stuff is out of those. Yeah. Because I feel like it could be different stuff since you're not you're more likely to get you have better percentage to get ultra rares and stuff out of the super dupers. So you the common things you don't get out of it. So maybe you can get a common thing, see what that is. Maybe it's pretty cool looking. I need the pirate hat in the do I, I had the bandana. There's another bandana I want to go get. Uh, you have the red one? I had the red one. Uh, the, the bank robber mask is the black one. Is it? Okay. I don't have that one yet. Yeah, I think it's I did get the Ooga Booga mask, though. The screen <laughs> mask. Ooga Booga. I was very happy about that. Stupid dog made me look bad. <laughs> Oh, Courage, I fucking... That, that was such a good show. Courage's voice actor was amazing. <laughs> oh, yeah. I know how absurd that sounds, because you think, well, Courage is a dog, he doesn't talk. But he does talk. No. Yeah, he, he does. He talks a lot. Amazing. He may only talk for, like, actually, like, a minute per episode, but, like, that's it. But it's so good. The things <laughs> I do for love... Says. And he says that in every episode too. That his actual catchphrase. Back when shows actually had catchphrases, those were the days. Yeah. Bosses in this game should get harder to kill the more people are around or join in, or in the area. Uh, that might be a thing for raid bosses in Legacy. I'm sure. But as it is, the reason farming Don Doom and Bad Max is so frustrating right now is because there aren't any groups. Yeah. Because if there are groups, there'd be four grape cards. When you combine an item, does it become untradeable? Yes. Yeah. I think I've combined an item. No, I have. Some other character. But it does indeed become untradeable. But yeah, to... my hollow suit right now is entirely untradeable because I did it. I combined all that. Yeah, but uh, I think the whole raid boss thing would be fit into Legacy much better than a retro. Oh yeah, I think in Legacy they'll make it entirely different. You're talking about how the combat's like practically different. Brizzy was the other day in his stream. I think it was yesterday or something. Combat that isn't just sitting here and right clicking or left clicking would be amazing. Yeah, that's. I think that's what he was trying to explain was the fact that it's different. Not having those annoyingly annoying ranged enemies that annoyingly annoying slap you from annoyingly miles away, annoyingly. <laughs> yeah. I I think I'm excited to see what they're gonna do with Legacy. I know it's gonna take a long, a while, but once Retro's out, I'll have plenty of stuff to yeah. waste time with until then. Yeah. And I don't mind the whole left clicking thing until Legacy comes out, but I know once Legacy comes out, going back to Retro is going to feel weird. But... You can always use rockets or thrown weapons if you get really tired true, of it. True, true. Yeah, just go get yourself a rocket, go run around with that, go kill things with that. A lot more people are starting to show up, I have a feeling that uh, it's about to spawn. Uh, Y2J. What does Y2J mean? I have no idea. Y2J Chris Jericho. Mm. Right to full. Hey. Time to sell things. Time to right click like 40 times. <laughs> <laughs> I wish the inventory space would be bigger or like there's an actual banking system. It's gonna be. Um, I'm gonna have such a hard time when it comes to baking stuff. Yeah. Uh, whenever Legacy comes out. Chris Jericho, best WWE superstar ever. I have no idea what WWE is. If it's it's that WrestleMania stuff, whatever. Yeah. There's a guy here named Chris Jericho, but it's Y2J. Hmm.
Belkarai Nellis. Hello. Borrow Ataro, you can borrow three. <laughs> oh, you got a couple of the super duper ones in that. I got set. four. Nice. That was a good move. Hello. How are you doing? Alright, let's see. Custard Launcher 75, Proton Mace 77, Full Orange 74, Pants 65. Yeah, weapons are worth more. Yeah. That's good to know. Because if my inventory ever gets full... How do I insta-click everything? I just right-click it. Works for selling, too. Mm -hmm. I think I'm just gonna... Straight... Keep, uh... Weapons in my inventory if I'm farming. Just to farm for a little bit. Hello. And I keep getting full-on inventory. I just realized uh, I was getting attacked and somebody saved me. Give that man a medal. <laughs> We're 25% of the way there. And it's only been around 30 minutes. No, it's been an hour. Okay, well, four more hours. Jeez. Uh, sitting at 50 ish thousand? Yeah. That's about the average that people usually farm for before they go get Don't eggs. Don't forget to bring number two out, you still have that cash extra. Yeah, I just think it's too much trouble for like three extra taros. It's not worth it when you only get 20 taros a monster. True. I wonder, oh, I should probably put this in for ideas with Legacy. For the nanos, like the newer ones or something, if they want to change up the abilities. Where you could, uh, have a nano on when you're killing, like, a boss or something. It can have you a chance of extra loot, like a roll for loot. Like, because you know how only one person gets a crate? Oh, yeah. They should have it where you may also get a chance if you're using that specific nano with that ability. Well, I'm sure they'll rework the loot system in Legacy entirely. So maybe there could just be yeah. a nano that has a chance of doubling your crates. Yeah, that's true, that's true. Heck, maybe it could be the new number five nano if they do that, because number five got a bunch of candy crates. Oh yeah. Oh man, I'm excited to see what they'll do with Legacy when they when they have more stuff that comes out. That'll be nice to see. Oh uh, yeah, definitely. But honestly, I'm still super excited for the first sneak peek we're having right now, even though it's been like three days. Oh yeah, I'm just I'm just happy to be in this world, just the nostalgic. I'm happy to exist. Everything right here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. Life right now isn't that bad. Be cool if they release the game right after their beta. Probably. I was gonna do a 360 no scope, but the thing stunned me. <laughs> I missed. Is it really a no scope if you're still locked on though? Maybe. <laughs> Did you see a uh, Magic's uh, stream earlier? That the Magic says. No magical dealer. Yeah, Magic says he was doing Magic says. Oh, was he? Yeah. I was there. I, I got part. put on the dump or put on the bulldozer, bulldozer like immediately because I messed up. <laughs> I wasn't watching him during that part. That might have been when I left because I left his chat, his uh, stream on, but I didn't leave it. Uh, I wasn't watching the entire time. Yeah, Ronan was there. Saw him hanging around as Ben Tennyson. Yeah, actually, I think I saw Magic. It'd be nice if I'm like, then it cut out on me. Um, I saw Ronan on a stream when I like turned it on. I think he hovered over his name or something. Uh, like when he was moving, and I saw it. Yeah. Hey, you got over the gap without taking damage. 
a the man, the myth, the legend. The man with the most confirmed toxic spawn kills. <laughs> I might I might not even have the most toxic spawn kills. Yeah, yeah, actually you might not. There might be other people out there already. I'm hoping that what they do with a uh, retro, like once Friday hits, that they announce that they're gonna keep it out. They're gonna add a little bit more to it. Maybe not too much more, but like you know, a good amount, and then like a week later, see how it goes. If it goes good, then kind of release as much as they can at a time. Just but I also know that they've been going through like crazy and dealing with a lot of crap at the same time. So yeah. this week right now is a good break for them. Yeah. Nobody's on their back at all, like how they have been. It's nice. Yeah, Aquafina just got the max scatter gun. That's nice. Is that the level oh, five nice. one with the? Um, that's really big and blocky. I think that's it. Is it yeah. white and red? Yeah, white and red. Yeah. No offense, but I hope Aquafina isn't in my shard right now because me and a bunch of people are just chilling by a uh, Dawn Doom waiting. <laughs> so if Mad Max just spawn. I don't know how much longer we're gonna be waiting for Don Doom to spawn. Yeah, I'll be honest. I don't like the Bad Max set that much. Red just isn't really my color. I prefer like that deep red and green, like See, the Infinity franchise. Teal blue. Wait, what is it? Infinity franchise. Mm. You know what that is? I, it sounds familiar, honestly. I think I might be thinking of Reg Reggie Ice from uh, Pokemon, honestly. That's probably why it sounds familiar to me. Oh, Aquafina Shard only has like four people in Max. Lucky! Wow. Uh, the Infinity franchise is from a Lisa the RPG fan game called Lisa the Pointless. Uh, and I really hope they release the second chapter pretty soon, because the last chapter was... Uh, Christmas in uh, 2016. Somebody's over here. The 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 Y2J G, uh, Chris Jericho guy uh, just said, uh, "Yeah, the this is the sneak peek is is out. Uh, this is it for the sneak peek." And then he said, "Full releases in one to two weeks." That's weird. Prizzy, Prizzy said it in his live, you said. I don't recall that. Um, I didn't watch it. Yeah, he might be hearing wrong, because another guy just said, well, I know for sure that he said, uh, where's it at? So I can read it. They said this will be up for about a week. This guy just got wrecked. Ah! Oof. That feels bad, man. I'll watch that. Smacked that thing in the mouth, though. Hello. He went down like a <laughs> champ. Wasn't going down without a fight. Proton mace dentistry. I'm waiting for Dawn Doom to spawn. I just, just want a single piece. I haven't gotten anything yet because I haven't found one. Very nice weather we are having. Do you agree with this statement? Very nice weather we're having. Look at the sky, it is completely green, and there is a thing currently trying to eat our planet. Very nice weather we're having. Yes, I agree. <laughs> it's the way I like it right there. Sky green, a giant planet trying to eat us. I love it. That's the way I like to see the world. Yep. It's like you wake up the next day and it's actually like that in real life, and then you're just like, alright. Well, my future fall training has prepared me for this. <laughs> Where's Dexter? I'm ready to fight for his army of teens. <laughs> his not... army of adults that went missing. <laughs> <laughs> it's like all the people who played Fusion Ball was there, and they're just sitting there like, alright guys, what do we... the first thing, we gotta go through the academy. 
Ah, Academy. <laughs> Hit him with the ooh for it. Pistol and the Toxic Mask. Uh, the Toxic Mask has the same model as the Smelmet. Unfortunately, so you could just get a Smelmet from level 1 fusion spawns and say it's the Toxic Mask and nobody would be none the wiser. Wait, really? Yeah, you got that same model. It was like that in the original game too. Oof, that feels bad, man. It's a, is it a tradable item or no? No, I don't think any of the Dawn Doom items are tradable. Mm. Sadly. I wish they were. I would trade off my pants. Yeah, because if the mask is is tradable, then the name is probably where the money's gonna be after that. You know why the toxic spawns wear the gas masks? Because if they breathe themselves in, they'll die. Nice. They are that toxic. I'm like that. <laughs> Also, like, every fusion monster throws up every now and then. I'm sure you've noticed that, right? Wait, what is it? Every fusion monster will throw up on the ground every now and then. Yeah. I, I always wondered if they were, like, actually throwing up, or if it was the fact of, like, that's how they, like, were infecting the planet. That's probably but... how they're infecting it. I wonder if it's a mixture of the two. They throw up in order to infect the planet. Blindfolds were like a million taros. At least that's what I remember. Yeah, they were expensive. I tried getting my hands on one, and I realized how much money it was because somebody was like, "Yeah, I got one. I'll trade it to you." And I was like, "All right, how much do you want?" They're like a mil, and I'm like, "Okay, <laughs> I'm gonna just leave now." Crazy. I made a second character uh, today. I don't know if I'm uh. Exactly looking to uh, do with them. Yep. I haven't even finished the sneak peek with them yet. I think I got number two's nano and then I think I was done. Because I think my game crashed and I want to let me restart it. <laughs> Only got like three blindfolds, yeah. <laughs> Only three blindfolds? So you're telling me you only have three million Tauros? Just sitting in your inventory waiting for that day? Technically Tauros oh, didn't... Oh, Don Doom just came up. Oh, he did? Yep. That's 44. When does he die? Let me know. Just died. Alright, go ahead and set a timer. Yep. I typed in timer Don Doom instead of timer one hour. <laughs> Alright, so 44 in this server, so I'm gonna run right over to Mad Max. Mad Max, my bad. Mad Max. Might as well be Mad Max. He looks pretty mad to me. He's a gigantic oh, floating head. He looks pretty mad to me. And just playing this game makes me just so happy. Absolutely. Like, not even the fact that, like, there's not that much to do right now. Like, all I'm doing is just farming. Like, it just makes me so happy playing this game right now. I haven't been this happy about playing the game in a pretty decent amount of time. Yeah. I'm sure a lot of people that have been waiting for Fusion Fall are like that, too. Yeah. I'll never forget the day that I went and saw that, uh... I went to go play Fusion Fall because I was like, man, I really miss that game. I'm gonna go play it again because I had like just started playing it again, uh, like maybe like it was like two months ago, right before it went off. And then like I went off, went to go on one day, and I was like, Fusion Fall, and then like Fusion Fall Heroes announced, and I'm like, Fusion man. Fall Heroes. Ugh, I don't think I ever played that game. Like, oh, okay, it looks like just like they renamed it and they just changed it up how it works and stuff. I was like, all right, cool, I'll, I'll try it out. And I played like three games of it and I was like, okay, this is nothing like the same thing. 
they don't even have close to the same storyline you're playing as the heroes you don't, don't get like to be this. your own character so you can't self-insert yeah right i was so upset with everything on that Just, my heart broke when I found out that they just stopped making it and stuff. Yeah. I think I heard, uh... I can't remember who it said. It might have been Prizzy I was watching when he said it. I think he said that the reason CNN stopped was because of, uh... A lot of... They, st they, like, stopped partnering with somebody. And then, I think once the game, like, finally went offline, I think they didn't have, like, any coders anyways. Ooh. Like, the game wasn't getting any help, because they were all alone on it, and they weren't that good at it. As you can probably notice, I think they said. The Adventure Time stuff? Maybe? I think it was, like, right after that, I think everybody he said left. Uh. Now, see. The Adventure Time stuff was some of my favorite stuff. Because, uh, Jake's I'm a big fan of awesome. Adventure Time. Oh, it you said Jake's model was what? It was awesome. <laughs> it was weird. It was just four was... sticks and like a beam. Painted like Jake the dog. Jake the dog was my favorite. When I first saw him, I was a little upset. I know Finn's model was kind of gross. This shard I'm in sucks. Is it too crowded? No. The Dawn Doom spawn in the, uh... Hold on. Let's see. Uh, Dawn Doom spawns at 3... Or 2... Uh, 244. For me on Eastern. And, uh... The shard I'm in, uh, Bad Max spawns a minute later at 45. Oh. Because I came over and there was like five people here and I was like, um, how much longer it took for a spawn? And they're like, it was, uh, 45 east. Ugh. And like, next spawn is in an hour from now. I'm like, oh god. <laughs> Makes me feel so bad. Four more slots, then I can go sell them again. Uh -huh. How much? I have some things to sell. I don't know if I'm gonna get enough. I might have enough for like two eggs because I just spent all my stuff earlier. It feels like that one episode of South Park where they like grind a bunch in World of Warcraft. Oh my god. That was such a I'm... good episode. That was one of the only episodes of South Park I've actually watched fully, other than like maybe like funny clips here and there, because of the fact that when I started playing World of Warcraft, my uh, my mom's boyfriend, well, he was the one who got me into it, and he uh, he was like, have you ever seen South Park? And I was like, kinda, not really a full episode, and he goes, I want you to watch this full episode right here with me, and I was like, alright. Uh -huh. I'm like sitting there at like 11 years old, just sitting here watching a South Park episode of nothing but World of Warcraft, and I'm like, this is so funny. Uh -huh. It was so ridiculously funny. Iggy Q. I feel like that's like a known name or something. Wait. Hey, you're in my shard. We're in this. We're, we're in the same shard. I was actually just going over just to see if I can get a little bit more. <laughs> I won't. I'll, I'll move away from a different area of your main. I'll just go over to the right. All right. Because I know you, I know you're grinding for the full long run of the of all of it. I won't be here very long anyways, I'm probably gonna head off, go to bed soon. I've got right. a bunch of stuff to do. I gotta go get I gotta go turn in the rental car I'm using right now for my actual car tomorrow. Uh hello. And how are you doing today? Conversation. 
Hello. Conversation complete. <laughs> well, how much money are you at for Tauros? Uh, Thirty-four thousand. Nice. It's been about an hour. Twenty. Where's the time going? I looked like three minutes ago, and it's been twenty-two minutes. <laughs> the way life works. Hell, if I get a job and time goes by this fast, I might not mind it that much. <laughs> See, that's best, where you're wrong. The best scatter gun you can get right now is from Dawn Doom, and it's called the Master Spiral Spreader. Unfortunately, Are you using that one currently? Yeah, I have it. So, I use the single target one because it three shots the monsters. From Don Doom, of course. They're the best weapons mm -hmm. currently. And they are still the best weapons up until like level 7, I think. Oh, wow. That's definitely going to be worth getting a hold of. Yeah. I'm wondering what's going to happen with the fusion matter, like for the XP and stuff. Uh, They actually put a cap on it the day later, so people wouldn't get up to like 20,000, I think. Oh. So now it caps at five thousand. I'm pretty sure. At least that's what yeah. I understand. There might be like a, there might still be a bug with certain characters that let them go up to thirty thousand or whatever. Yeah, mine says fifty nine hundred right now. So pretty intriguing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is another good song. So I've been uploading my streams to YouTube, uh, mm -hmm. and I get like 14, 13 emails a day <laughs> about copyright claims, oh, which don't even, they don't even matter to me because I don't monetize my videos, and I don't think I ever will. I just put them on there so they can stay on there, you know? Mm-hmm. Is the name thing uh, that you have going on uh, in the settings? Going on? Yeah, it's in the settings. Okay. I turned that on because it's helpful. <laughs> it, it does look very helpful. Especially, Actually, like, for right future proofing and stuff, you know? Yeah. Like, in case anybody needs to go back and look at all the damage values they had set. I can just look at my videos. Hopefully they'll be able to read it and the bitrate isn't too bad. Oh. I turned them all on except for my name. I turned my name on because I'm an egomaniac. <laughs> I may do it. I may turn it on and off. I do it on World of Warcraft all the time when I turn my name on and off to see it. Okay. Sometimes it's satisfying just seeing your name there. Yeah. Names are also helpful because they show you, like, really far away monsters, too. Oh my god, they do. Like, see, like, uh, way over there. See on my stream, like, way over there on the left. Yeah. I'm actually heading right over to that area to clean those guys up. You would think with how many fusion monsters everybody in this game kills, the fuse would have no more army left, right? Yeah, right. <laughs> we eat fusion matter and turn it into things that make it more powerful, make us more powerful. Yeah, right. How is fuse gonna win? I'm just curious to know how any other planet lost. <laughs> well, they didn't have Dexter. <laughs> Honestly. Dexter is pretty much the main character. Let's be on. Let's be true. This is this is very true. Oh, are you gonna are you gonna choose a guide? Oh yeah, I'm choosing Double D. He's like my favorite. Like my guide choices are Dexter. I mean, uh, Double D, Dexter, Mojo, and Ben. 
Actually, no, it's Bim Bim Mojo. Yeah, I'm, I think I'm gonna honestly choose, uh, uh, Dexter. Yeah, he is the main character after all. <laughs> this is true. Without him, we would have already lost. <laughs> yeah. In one of the lore videos that Prizzy had made, it talks about how he had detected the first Terra Fuser, and that's how Fuse didn't eat us immediately. Oh, wow. I might have seen that. Oh, I should go back and watch him. Heck yeah. Prizzy videos are always worth watching again, and again, and again, and again, like I have. <laughs> Must know everything. Yeah, I see you off in the distance just chilling, farming over there. Jumping around, maxing and relaxing, all cool and well. Mm -hmm. Shooting some people up behind the school. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever happened to Fresh Prince of Bel Air memes? Oh god. Who knows, honestly. It's where it's like a new flavor of the week meme nowadays. Honestly, it, it is definitely... You hit it right on the nail with that. That's very true. Like a few weeks ago, or like a week ago, it was Rigby putting a tape into a radio and like immediately cutting out like when they hear like a second of the song. Mm -hmm. Now it's Rigby getting hit by a cart and yelling really loud. <laughs> I'm I'm excited for I just I just keep keep thinking about all the expansion and stuff whenever they finally like fully release the game all the things to do all the things to farm definitely god it's going to be so great oh I'm out of there's going to be weather yes. and legacy and that's the most exciting thing ever I remember you talking about it yesterday you were so hyped about it I love weather effects if any if any game I can mod has a mod that improves weather effects, I'll get it. <laughs> like Fallout 4, Fallout New Vegas, any Bethesda game or any like game in general that has mods, you you can mm. bet I have the improved weather mod. Definitely. Wow. Nope. Full of crates. What I just realized about this uh thing with the uh, names is the fact that uh, it helps out because now if you don't know where to exactly go and you're not really looking at your map, you can see where the friendlies are. Yeah. Oh, uh, you know what? Actually, once I get done selling all these, I'm gonna go over and... Oh, I have to open this. I'm gonna go over to... Uh... Oh, what's the bot that's over there? What's his name? Edgar? Yeah. I'm gonna climb it and then see what names I can see from a distance. Oh yeah. The treehouse. Mm-hmm. Can you see the treehouse? No, I don't think you can see the tree treehouse from here. Fuck to say, there's no yeah. way. That monster just slapped me as I was going through the portal. Nice. Sounds like a very successful time. So the treehouse would be in that direction I'm staring. Yeah, I can't see it. Yeah. I think it only renders the area like a low poly area directly to mm -hmm. the side of us. Might not even be low poly, they might just render that entire area. I don't know. I wish I could like directly ask devs and stuff. The closest I've gotten to asking is like asking prison some stuff, but I don't like asking people things like that. I'm yeah. sure like I barely ask any questions, and if I do, I try to ask, like, unasked questions that are fun to answer, you know? Mm-hmm. I don't feel like there's a reasoning to asking so much, you know? Oh, hey, you're sitting right here. <laughs> Opening crates. Mm-hmm. I'm looking over at your stream, like, you got anything good? But then, I, again, I, I just got the same stuff. Because yeah. I pulled up, people are leaving. It's like it's all the same stuff. Those are number one's glasses that you have, right? 
I think so. I did, what are they called? Rock and roll shades. Rock and roll shades. Hmm. I haven't gone on them yet. I also haven't opened that many eggs. I opened up like seven or eight in it. I bet I've opened up like 60 at least. Oh yeah, with last night with you buying that many? <laughs> I'm gonna get even more okay, when I get 100k. Who knows, maybe I'll just sit on the 100k. Maybe I'll Ooh. like just try and get as much money as possible. Just to have it. Oh, actually, you know what? Grinding for the money to keep the money is definitely worth in the aspect because of, uh, what's it called? Let's see, um... Like, what I'm thinking is, the blindfold market is probably going to be so inflated because everybody's gunning for them. Mm -hmm. Like, they're going to be gone anytime soon. But no, the yeah. future's here to stay. Like, I'm just going to keep these few to give them away. Anybody wants them. Yeah. You should honestly uh, keep them for uh, anybody who doesn't have them in your chat and stuff, and who comes and watches your stream. For definitely. Stuff, you know? Yeah, definitely. That's an amazing idea. Hear that, guys? Free blindfolds eventually. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna grind so hard, I'm gonna get my inventory full, and once trading comes out, hit me up. <laughs> You're gonna look like Oprah over there with blindfolds. Oh, I'm gonna have you to. Get you get a blindfold! You get a blindfold! Everybody gets a blindfold! That's gonna have to be a meme now. <laughs> For the people who don't have them. Yeah, people... I think the people who are grinding right now don't understand about the fact that it's a... Uh, it's like everybody has them. Supply and demand. Yeah. I guess the only reason that like anybody's gonna even buy one off of anybody else is because of the fact they don't want to have to open up a million eggs and have a chance of not gaining still, you know? If that's the case, they're probably gonna sell for around 2,000 taros. Mm-hmm. They're not gonna sell for that many, I think, honestly. I think they're better just to keep to give away. I'll probably hold on to one if I get one from my cousin. Yeah. If he wants one. Because I know he'll probably... Once he gets... Once he plays more, he'll get past me. Because I won't be able to play as much. But then I'll surpass him. I will surpass you. <laughs> I will be the thing to surpass Metal Gear. The weapon to surpass the Metal Gear. Gary's mod is full of those. <laughs> <laughs> I remember I put like a bunch of jets on a Jeep with some spinning lightsabers. <laughs> It was wonderful. <laughs> oh, I got the Ooga Booga mask. Oh, I got the Rock and Roll Shades. Hey. I'll take that. That's a win. Oh, by the way, I got a thing called a, a Beagle Puss. It's the arrow that goes through your head. Yep. I don't know if you've happened to get it yet, but I got it out of like a normal crate or whatever for like level two or whatever. Yeah, they're, they're cool. level one drops from fusion spawns. Okay, I did not know that. But I've gotten them before. Is the Uga Booga mask tradable? No, I have to sell it. Can't even sell things that aren't tradable, I don't think. Oh, what is the point of having them then if you have them already? To store them in your bank and show them off like a certain person tried to show me earlier what he did. <laughs> well, I have one already. What's the point of having another? Yeah. Oh, this is bad, man. I'm gonna buy one of the standard eggs. Let's see what I get out of it. You got a football helmet. Football. Football. I still haven't gotten the baseball cap, actually. With the mission? No, the baseball cap. Like, uh, it's the item that Prezi has on his oh. main character. I, I think I know what you're talking about now, honestly. Yeah. I think I'm gonna go uh, combine the uh, what's it called the no, oh, let's see the practice sword with the um, proton meta mace. Oh yeah. 
I kind of wish combining things would make a different appearance. Oh, you mean like combine their models? Somewhat? Wouldn't that defeat like the, the purpose of the crockpot? Uh, kind of. It would make different models that you can't get otherwise, I would think. Because I don't want you to be able to get that same model out there. Kind of like how you can get the gas mask. It would have to be like a choice if you want to combine the models or not. Yeah, know? yeah, 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 for sure. Because I definitely want the stats that are on my meta maze on a piece of stick, you know? <laughs> yeah. Like, Just I'd be able to hit monsters and one-shot them with the stick. Take the mace, part of the mace off of it, and stick it on the sword. Bam. Best weapon. Exactly. Simon Axe the sword that Frizzy has is pretty cool. The blue one that's, like, curved. Oh, the Foster Blade? Is that what that's called? Yeah. That is so sick. I love the name because it just reminds me of Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends. That's actually what it's based on. The F from Foster's I... Home. Yeah. That's... Oh, wow. The realization in that just hit me. Yeah. I had some realizations over in Reza's stream. How uh, her Discord is called the Residences, and how people are called citizens. I just realized, like, that was, like, a whole thing. Oh, wow. And when I was playing League, I had, like, a pi an epiphany as to why inhibitors are called inhibitors. It's because they <laughs> inhibit the enemy minions, and when they break, they stop inhibiting, inhibiting them. Mm-hmm. Reza said, are you okay? So I went to go take a nap, and then I woke up and ate a pizza. <laughs> 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 I'm living the life. Playing the best game of all time, you know? Hell yeah. New did follower. I, did you ever, uh... Oh, Siak, thank you for the follow, man. I appreciate that. Thanks for stopping by tonight. So, what did were you just... ever get to fight Fuse whenever he was out? Yeah, I got to fight him a bunch. I would... he, does he drop his own, like, loot and gear? No, he doesn't. Oh. At least not 100, like, I'm pretty sure. But I would hang out around his lair, because people would usually want parties for him. So I'd hang out and say, looking for mercenary for hire, or whatever, something stupid. <laughs> I would be like helping with Fuse, just in fight. But that's pretty much what I did all day. I wasn't farming, just helping people kill Fuse, because he's pretty difficult. Yeah. I watched uh, people fight him and stuff some of those old videos and stuff and it was it was it looks like a big pain yeah honestly i can't wait to fight fuse again i can't wait to fight fuse for the first time i never got the chance to yeah i don't think frizzy did either like most of the devs i believe haven't actually played this game Handman actually didn't play it at all so if he's playing this i hope he's having fun yeah, I hope he's putting time and stuff into something that he can enjoy, you know? Yeah. Panman's a music guy. In case you didn't know. I did not know that. So he does all the music and stuff? Yeah, he does all the music for Legacy, which it is wonderful. I have heard some of the um, music and stuff from the... Uh, the live streams? Uh, yeah. Yeah, he did that. And the one that they did for the... Uh, what is it? I guess the trailer, trailer for it? Yeah, yeah, he did that too. It's so nice. Yeah, he's really good. Sometimes really I get really upset good. and wonder why I can't be as good as him, and then I realize, you know, he's probably had, like, years and years of experience. Because I've yeah, looked at, like, his videos right and stuff. There. Yeah, I've looked at his videos and stuff, and I've seen all the equipment he has. He probably oh, wow. has enough money to buy all those things and the fancy samples to use them with, you know? Wow. Meanwhile, I am, like, just stuck with the bottom-of-the-barrel free sample stuff. Well, you gotta start somewhere. I'm sure he started somewhere. Yeah. So I named my second character, by the way. I named it Grim's Scythe. Grim's Scythe. Just so it could be from Grim, uh, Billy and Mandy. Heck yeah. Because I tried to take Grim Reaper and it was already taken. Yeah, I'm sure that was like the first name taken. <laughs> oh yeah. I'm sure that was right up there. Gotta go. That moment you 
look and see Mojo Jojo's uh, minions carrying you around, but Mojo Jojo's not here. Yeah. Where are you at, bro? Eddie says in one of the missions that the cankers aren't around anymore, which is, uh, it can't be taken the wrong way, but I guess they're just off, you know, safe somewhere, waiting mm -hmm. for Fuse to eat them. <laughs> I'm hoping in Legacy that, like, there are just so many missions and quests and stuff to do yeah. that you feel like you never run out of content. Like, whether you hit max level and you run out of actual, like, storyline stuff before they add on anymore, that it's like, they add, uh, what's it called? Like, they have, like, daily missions and stuff, you know? Mm. I feel like that'll be worth doing for them. So you want to know why factions like Ed, Ed, and Eddie, and Kids Next Door, and all them have actual, like, fighting abilities versus Fuse, even though, like, they're just, like, imaginations and stuff? Wait, what is it? Like how Foster's home for imaginary friends, all the imaginary friends can fight against Fuse's monsters. Like the kids next door and Ed, Ed and Eddie and them. Now Ed's castle is like still standing, like one of the last things standing. Yeah. It's because imaginary energy is a thing, and that is apparently really effective versus Fuse's forces. And Dexter had actually just started researching that. Yeah, wait. That wasn't one of the... A uh, quest that you would do in the original game, I think. Yeah. He says that. I I do remember him saying that. Dexter says that, and when you go to his lab, and that's how the nanos are made, I think. Yep. Oh, that's super sick. Yeah. I'm surprised I remember it honestly. And that's how like the K and D are such a fighting force, because like even in the show, it's alluded to, I guess, that they might just be, you know, imagining it. Yeah, imagining the entire... them going on missions and all this other stuff. Yeah. Yeah. But, uh, because imaginary energy is a thing, it's pretty much... it's pretty much real. <laughs> yeah. That's really sick. And like how Dexter's technology and the imaginary energy can like coincide and stuff, or what, or not coincide, co cooperate and stuff like that. I think that's amazing. Hmm. Technically, imagination energy could be like energy, anything. It's just like how kids have the most of it. That's my, that might be why our characters we play as are so young. Yeah. It's probably because the, that's probably why the fact of uh, there's no adults. Well, there's still father. Yeah, father. But father is practically like made up of something like that, or has the skin of something like that, right? Yeah. He is anger incarnate. I think I think somebody made like a theory of him being like an entity of kids fearing abusive parents or something, or when oh, wow. their parents are angry. Not abusive. That's kind of mean. But like their fear of their parents being angry, that's what father is personified or whatever. Yeah. That would make sense actually because of the fact that he's always mad and stuff. Angry. Has fire everywhere. Mm. Ooh, I like this song. I like songs with like calming roads and stuff. I think that's what they're called, roads. Hopefully, yeah, I normally uh, What's up? I listen to like a uh, laid back uh, anime beats and stuff all the time. Chill hop is my thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was gonna say I was hoping that Motor Runner doesn't slap me while I'm going to sell stuff again. <laughs> All right, crates. Drink the water. Stay hydrated, Axel. Smart, smart. Very nice weather we are having. Do you agree with this statement? No, I, I wish do not agree a with this statement. <laughs> I wish. I wish there was a small chance of a. Getting a um, what's it called? Like a uh, like cosmetic items from uh, the crates. Yeah. Like, 
slight change. That'd be nice. I think in later, in the past, you do get some cosmetics. It's just there aren't many level 4 cosmetics, you know? Yeah. Like, I can check mine now. They're all, like, level 1. Yeah, all these cosmetics are level 1, except for the Master Toxic Mask. So that might not- that might be why they don't drop from a level 4 crates, you know? kind of funny too like most of the accessories in fusion fall are level one too so they're like mostly accessible in the future i'm sitting here talking my mic was muted you were talking about getting the baseball bat right the baseball bat I oh think... or the cap oh the cap yeah did you get it yeah okay the cap i, I got the um bat as well as like I just got it again, if you want to hey. hold on to it for you. I'm sure I'll get it eventually. Yeah. I need to fix my freaking posture. I can tell. I'm just cleaning my back's health. I won a pillow in a giveaway from Resonance's stream, and it, it has been helping with my lower back a lot, because my chair isn't the best. It was like an extra DX Racer pillow, and she sent me some G Fuel to sample along with it. I love G Fuel a lot, and I wish I could get more. <laughs> I have not tried it, but I have heard many good things about it. Yeah, you should definitely order some. Pretty good. Um, just just money. It's like one of the few water adding things that I actually enjoyed. <laughs> Times like this I really wish I had a count or something of how many monsters I killed. Because I look yeah, over right. and I see I've been streaming for an hour and 50 minutes already. <laughs> Jesus. Although, I think I'll call it quits at 3.30. Yeah, I think I'm calling it quits right now. Uh, you're gonna be done? Yeah, I just, right. uh, combined my... Hey, what's going on? I just combined my, uh... Style sword in the rotund mace. Yeah, in the mace, and it worked. So now I have a stick that hits as hard as a mace. Sweet. I just kind of DC. I say kind of because I can't. It won't let me click on back onto the screen or anything. Ah, oh, maybe you crashed. Uh, I think I crashed. Gotta go. Did you crash while moving between an area? No, I was, uh, I pressed the full, full screen on on accident, so I pressed full screen off again, uh, and then it crashed. Old games usually have problems with full screening and stuff. Yeah. Alright, well, it's allowing me to go back on the, the client open it back up, so. Uh, I'm good. But, good luck with your, uh, stuff. I, I guess, uh, will you be on tomorrow? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, I'll probably be on as well. Sweet. All right, well. I'll leave your stream open for you. Thank you. If you need to mute yeah. it, mute the tab. Don't mute the player itself. Because if you do that, because it, uh, it'll get rid of the play. Got you. Farming Mad Max for the past six hours. Oof. I hope you get mm -hmm. at least a few crates from that. All right, well, thanks for stopping by, Alley Cat. I hope you have a nice mm -hmm. night. You too, Axel. Sweet. Later, man. I'm being attacked. Being attacked while I want tabbed. I saved myself. Aha. Uh -huh. Well, we're about halfway to my goal. <laughs> Maybe I'll farm 
like tomorrow to 250,000. Just to like brag about how much Taros I farmed. Uh, that would be cool. Just post it in Prezi's Discord. Like, look at all of my money. I am rich. <laughs> would be like an actual rich person. Gotta stay hydrated. If I could consistently two shot the toxic spawns with Buttercup out, I would. Nice. Yeah. If I, I was saying, if I could uh, consistently be two shot the toxic spawns with Buttercup out, then I would, you know, have her out. But it seems like the only enemies I can consistently two shot are the ranged ones over here, the dreadheads. But they're ranged, so every time I aggro one, I will constantly take damage, pretty much instantly. Kinda sucks, but hey, I don't think anybody else has the same idea as me farming the toxic spawns. Either that, or I'm probably on like my own shard. All right, so first of all. We're probably not going to go over to Down Doom, so I'm going to turn this timer off before it scales, scares the heck out of me. Got nothing from the farming. Ouch. Sorry to hear that, man. Hopefully, tomorrow, there'll be a dev or something, and it'll be nice and spawn a bunch of things. <laughs> Inventory's full. But yeah, I'll only manage to get the items I have now from Dundum is because um, the dev spawned them, like 80 of them, before he went to sleep for everybody to farm. I got like five crates in total. Got four pairs of pants, the gun, and uh, the muscle spiral spreader. Because I had already gotten like the gun mask from Dundee two times before. You know, before the admin spawned him in. But hey, I got pretty lucky. I guess unlucky as well, because it was just four pairs of pants, but hey, whatever, man. <laughs> oh my goodness, I just realized I was 69 followers. Hey! <laughs> That's wonderful. Hello. Open up these crates. Thousand arrows. Oof. Very nice weather we are having. Do you agree with the statement? The word Gucci got banned. Oh. Halfway there. Living on a prayer. And Tenucci. Antonucci's banned. Gucci. Gucci is indeed banned. Oof. <laughs> Guess I shouldn't say banned. More like not on the white list. I'll definitely clip it if I do open up those eggs. Showing off my slope jumping skills. Which arguably are not that good.
I feel when you get two crits in a row and kill the monster in two hits. Uh, back on that grind. Maybe in Legacy they'll have like a system where grind grinders like me or farmers or whatever can you know get rewarded hard heavily. <laughs> it's fun to speculate. But anyway, we're halfway to our goal of 100,000 Taros, and hopefully we'll get it tonight. Then I can post it all over the Fusion Fall Discord. <laughs> uh. Maybe I'll get like a completely even number so people will think it's fake. Pretty funny. <laughs> hey, see ya. He was so wonderful. It's probably like the only reason I can farm monsters so fast like this. Yeah, I hope the beta comes out pretty soon before you go to school too. Definitely. Go to school while the game is out, you're not gonna have time to play the game. Ah, that's gotta suck. I hope the full game comes out before I have to get a job. The grind, yeah, definitely. I remember those in Mission Drought at level 35 that gave me a lot of trouble when I was a kid. But because I usually got like on a private shard most of the time when I was a kid, 20 days. Oh, I don't think it'll come out in 20 days. Maybe the second sneak peek might come out in 20 days, but not the full game. I'm sorry, man. I could be wrong. Don't take my word. But uh, yeah, that was indeed a mission drought at level 35, and I had like a hard time getting to level 36. I know for sure I farmed around Green Maw and got a bunch of cannonball boots. No, was the boots? Yeah, it was the boots. Five classes? Huh. You mind telling me what those classes are? I can't believe I'm still so nostalgic over this game. And I don't think I farmed over in this area when I played in the future before. I farmed over where the motor raptors are. Posture, Axel. Fix it! Anatomy, biology, chemistry, communications, and physiology. Those sound pretty interesting. I only know what like three of them are. <laughs>
Hopefully you do well. I hope you do well in those classes, man. Yeah, I hope you do really well in them. Wish you the best of luck. Ah, itchy nose. Five more crates, then I can sell them. This is like how hard you had to grind for a quarter of a level, I'm pretty sure. If you were in a mission drought. Yo, I'm sure I wouldn't mind at all. Actually, you know, I don't think mission droughts would be that difficult to get over if uh, if you raced a lot. Now that I think about it. Because racing does give a bunch of fusion matter. If you do it well. That was cool already. Ah, nice. But yeah, honestly, I cannot wait to do some racing. It's going to be like my goal to get number one on every track. Like, I'm never going to stop. No, it probably won't get me anywhere in life, but it's what I want to do. never once did the racing. I think I did it like three times in total. My entirety, in the entirety I played uh, Hello. in the old game. Racing is difficult. Like, very difficult. Unlike um, some of the later levels, especially. But... Yeah, but uh, some of the earlier levels in racing, like uh, the Candy Training Grounds and Okio Tai, they're pretty easy. Hello, and how are you doing today? Seems like every time I sell my crates, I get around 2,000 to 3,000. Nice. Number two, lunch money. Bye -bye. Yeah. Good roommates are pretty nice. If I ever do have to move in with a roommate, I hope I'm the good roommate. I'm not, like, you know, making things annoying. Oh, I canceled his heal. That's a bug, I think. Let's see. I don't know how I did that. I have to clip that. I have to see what happened. See, it's a good thing I record every second of gameplay. <laughs> Jack Spicer! That's a guy from Shaolin Showdown. First semester of la last year, my roommate never wanted to leave our dorm and it sucked. Uh, I can see why that would be bad.
Oh, I don't really have experience with dorms and roommates and the such. Or school in general, really. <laughs> Loud sleeper. Oh, no. Like a lion roaring. Yeah. That's gotta suck, man. I'm sorry you had to put up with that. Having your sleep interrupted sucks. need to remember to blink. <laughs> I just caught myself not blinking for a while. Noise cancelling headphones. Ah, oh, man. Some noise cancelling headphones are actually really high quality, like mine. Mine are noise cancelling. They make it so I pretty much can't hear my own voice echoing through my room, and I can only hear my voice, like, through my own head. Which is a really odd way to describe it, but it's pretty much how it is. But yeah, since I made music, I wanted to get a really nice pair of, head or pair of headphones or headset. Yeah, I think it's headphones, actually, since they don't have a microphone. But, uh, because I made music, I wanted to have a really nice headset, and I've had this headset for a few months now, and I'm in love. It has been wonderful. I can hear so many more things, with, and it's helped me with mixing and stuff like that so much more. I'm sure an even better headset would... Head, head, I'm sure an even better pair of headphones would be, you know, even better. I'd be able to hear even more. I guess that's just how things usually are. The more expensive they are, the better they are. <laughs> well, I guess it's not necessarily true for all things. Wow, I can't believe my inventory is full already. I've got lo-fi hop on right now. I think it's like chill hop or something. Let me check. Lo-fi hip hop radio. Yeah, so pretty much. my go-to farming music. I could listen to it for, for infinity. I actually hope they'll add more songs later. No. Just to spice it up. when you get common item from a super duper chest. <laughs> Pretty good, huh? I thought uh, they were having compatibility issues with Mac. Are you running it on like a 
A virtual machine or something? But anyway, I'm glad you got it playing pretty good. I think everybody deserves a shot to play Fusion Fall. I wish I could help all those people that are having issues with not having the correct files and stuff. But I wouldn't want to bug people like that, you know? So, okay, so you see this circle that appears on my head whenever I use a money nano? It's supposed to be a crown. It's sideways. <laughs> ah. used to have a setup like that back when my computer was really bad where I'd watch Twitch streams or YouTube music or regular music on my PS3. I had this really cool headset that could like plug into my computer and the AV cords in my PS3 as well. It was super like, you know, well there's the level design thing Prizzy was talking about. <laughs> PC just haven't set it up. Uh, hope you can get it set up eventually. Beatable missions where you would kill like a hundred of one enemy would be nice in Legacy. Yeah, those are like the mainstream games that don't require that a, a lot to play, you know? But those are some pretty good games, I will agree. Even though I don't really play them. I used to play League. I got Diamond 4 playing literally only Ramus. <laughs> this guy's up on the staircase. Get down. I have been stunned. Have I ever played Rocket League? Uh, no. I didn't- I've never thought that would be a game that I would enjoy, so I just never bothered buying it or anything like that. Anyway, hello! It's Astrori. <laughs> Astrori, I guess. Thanks for stopping by tonight. I hope you're having a nice night. At night.
I will say though, I am pretty decent at a game called Heroes of the Storm. I've managed to get Grandmaster, and I think my highest rank was number 113 in the entirety of North America. Not to toot my own horn, but I was pretty good at that game. Astro RL. <laughs> well, it's nice to know how to pronounce your name now. Thanks for telling me. Anyway, if you're just now stopping by and wondering what I'm doing, I am farming to get 100,000 Taros. And I'm probably not even going to bother getting more blindfolds. Yeah, it's the it's the Blizzard MOBA with like the Overwatch heroes, StarCraft, World of Warcraft, Diablo, stuff like that. There was actually this, yeah, there was actually this pretty big event between two streamers, Bam Bam and Munfair, and I got to play as part of the Grandmaster team from Munfair, and of course I carried the game single-handedly <laughs> as Zuljin. Yeah, I think collectively I've hit around 120k, if I remember correctly. So, if there was a collective amount of Taros farmed, I'd probably hit 120k. I just want 100,000, you know, at this one time. Yeah, usually people are busy waiting around at Don Doom or Bad Max's spawn instead of farming Taros. So that's probably why I'm so alone here. Either that or I got lucky and I'm in like my own shard. <laughs> Alright, so Hero's ranking system, basically Grandmaster was pretty much Challenger in, from League of Legends. So it went Bronze, Silver, Gold, Platinum, Diamond, and then the special ranks that are Master and Grandmaster. Using Microsoft Windows 10 on your MacBook Pro. Nice! I'm glad you got everything working. Yeah, it's really boring waiting an hour for them to respawn, so... Usually, I would suggest people to just set a timer as soon as, you know, he dies, and then go off and do something, like play a different game, or go farm and go to the junkyard, you know? Highest you've ever gotten to League was Master? That's pretty good. That guy just, like, came in from a cannon. <laughs> that was awesome. Yeah, I hear people in League drop out of those high ranks pretty fast. Because it's, it's pretty pretty competitive, because League is so popular. Hi Astral, thanks for stopping by tonight. <laughs> League is pretty toxic. Cheers, mate. Yeah. I think once I hit 100,000 Taros, I'm going to... I don't know, if I have time left, I might switch over to Fallout 4 for a bit. Right now you're in Diamond? Well, nice. That's cool. I think I'm unranked in Heroes of the Storm currently, because this season just rolled over. And I don't think I'll be playing HOTS for a while until they iron out the real issues they're having with rank. Did you just follow me? I'm not sure. I should have gotten an alert. I can check real quick. You've been following me? Ah, thank you man. I appreciate that. Yeah, Heroes of the Storm is 100% free. It's actually pretty hard to buy. <laughs> it's, it's pretty difficult to buy the things you want in that game. Because they hit away the, like, gems or stuff of whatever you need to buy. And you can only get skins with it. You can't buy characters. <laughs> mm.
new follower, Astral98. Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate that. Thanks for stopping by tonight and all that good stuff. All right, let's check my alert box real quick to see. Dashboard. Eduardo. Number two. Astro RL, you. Wait a second. How long have you been following me? Hey, I'm glad you've been playing this game too. I hope more people can enjoy it. I hope this game gets really popular when the pass releases too. Because I know whenever Prezi streams this game, he rakes in like 80 viewers average, and that's incredible. But yeah, if you did follow Astro, I appreciate that. Thank you so much, man. Alright, let's open these crates. Ugh, gumballs. Hello. And how are you doing today? Using this app called Parallels Desktop on my MacBook Pro and I'm loving it because it's free. I'm glad you're having I'm glad you're loving it. <laughs> yeah, I'm glad you're able to play this game on a Mac. Because there are a lot of people who can't. I think I bought a single nano potion or weapon boost this entire time. I probably don't need to. I do too. I really like honestly. They they progress should what I think progress should go by faster now that um, now that everything's been set in stone and what they're doing and stuff. Like they're just looking for bugs now. But once they finish up this sneak peek, I'm sure progress should go a lot faster than how it's been going. At least that's what I think. I hope Will Mayhem can get rest before he like goes back to work, because he's a trooper. Yeah, I would too, but uh, that would be kind of a bummer, because I've already spent so much time on this character, you know? <laughs> I would still play it, definitely. I would still be happy to play this game. Like, no matter what they do, as long as I'm able to play this game, I will be happy. Especially if I get to be Axel Windmill. Like, like, that's my OG name. I'm grinding just to grind <laughs> at this point. But if the, the the past letting us keep our characters, if it does come out, that's a bonus. I'm just grinding to grind. Because it's something to do, and I love this game and just want to do stuff in it. Not to waste 75k on eggs. I hope you get everything you want. And more. <laughs> I think I've spent like 70k on eggs so far. I have a video of me opening up like 30 or 40 eggs or so. 
on my Twitch. Where did I get this pistol? This is the Don Doom pistol. It is from Don Doom. Yeah. This is currently the best single target weapon in the future so far. No, I don't think you can get them in the past. You can get a level 8 version, I think, but they're kind of bad. Uh, in the past, Don Doom and Bad Max spawn in their same locations, and they have twice their normal level. But at that point, you're going to have much higher level stuff <laughs> when you do start grinding them. But uh, the Don Doom pistol, you get this from Don Doom. He spawns an hour after he dies. Uh, I can show you on the map exactly where he spawns. It is right here. And I'll keep it on here for a bit. Yeah, I think you can get the gear in the past. <laughs> Alright, Astro, good luck with that. I think you can get the gear in the past, so I could be wrong. I just know that Don Doom and Bad Max spawn in the past. This guy is running from me. Ah, first blindfold, 200k. Wow, that's a lot. I'm glad you got your blindfolds, man. I've gotten pretty lucky with him. Yeah, Doom and Max both spawn. Oh, yeah. Duh. Probably haven't seen it, but I have five blindfolds. <laughs> uh, I've gotten super lucky with them. Honestly, though, I don't think they're going to be in that much demand when the past comes out. Like, they were in demand in the old game because the Academy removed the future and they weren't achievable anymore. And that's why they were worth so much, because less and less people played from the future. And they were less and less in rotation. It became, like, sort of a thing, I guess. At least that's what I think throw that in there as a disclaimer. I'm not, like, the absolute word. Go. Uh, the thought occurred in my head to try and get to one million Taros before the before the sneak peek ends. I think I want to punch myself in the mouth. <laughs> Do I know of any glitches they've had other than spinning one? Um, so far, I think there might be an issue where if you transition areas, you might crash or lose connection to the network. I think there's a post in the forums about MacBook Pro using Windows OS. Not I can. Uh, I think that would be a good idea after you search for it, you know? Because if you make a duplicate thread or anything, it'll get locked. It'll get locked. But Aquafina says it would be cool Friday if they raise the level cap and add a new map part. Um, that would be incredibly difficult, and they probably aren't going to do that because, because of how this game is. It's a private server. It's not like they can edit anything in the game itself. You know what I mean? Like, they can put monsters down because that's server side info, but they can't edit anything else. Like, drop rates, monsters, stuff like that. It's all pretty much server-side. They can't, like, change parts of the map or add in roadblocks or anything. Well, 
I think it might have been so difficult because it's only been one person working on it. Um, and for a long while, he got hung up on Eduardo's path. This is what I've heard, at least. And um, not only that, they have to place each monster and set their path individually. So, like, this guy, he has his own monster path and monster spawn point. So he will probably one run from here, like spawn here, run this way, run this way, then run back to his spawn point. So they have to do that manually for every monster in the game. And I figure that might take a while. I think they also have to add mission paths as well in place NPCs. I, I, I'm pretty sure I could be wrong. Don't take my word for this, it's just what I've heard and what I think. You should always try and get as much information as you can, not just from one person, you know? Especially if you can get the information from a dev, though. Wonder if there'll be a way to get stink fly wings, I hope. But, um, usually if Prizzyfied or any other dev is streaming, uh, you could ask them a question, just like... Yeah, they are putting them together. Full of the boxes. But, um, what I was saying is, if Prizzyfied's streaming, you can usually ask him questions about the game and he'll answer them. Um, same with Tech the Noob, I think, sometimes. So, I'm sure he's probably just, like, mainly working on the visual aspect and all the logos and stuff, you know? But, um, if you do wind up trying to ask Chrissy Fight for questions, I would recommend, like, you know, pacing your questions, not asking them all, in all caps, like, 30 times in his chat in two seconds. <laughs> like a lot of people do. Because he's much more likely to answer them without getting you know, upset or just flat out ignoring them if you do it, you know, sparingly. At least that's what I think. I don't know Frizzy that well. I'm sure he might love getting questions. I hope he considers us friends, too, because <laughs> I hang out on this stream pretty much all the time. And who knows, maybe I will have a change of heart eventually and try and apply for CT. Oh, I doubt it. Alright, we are 70% of the way to our goal. I'm out of water. I have to get water right now. <laughs> I will be right back. Oh, uh, CT? CT means, uh, community manager, I think? Or community team, it means community team. I might apply to get on there if I do have a change of heart, but I doubt it. But anyway, I'll be right back, I'm gonna get some water. back and I think uh, Prizzy is the community manager actually community manager and he does some of the programming world bend it world bit he does a little bit of everything that to think about it except for music but yeah not only do I have water I have a banana to snack on I have to start eating healthier I've been eating nothing but pizzas and hot pockets for a long time now because of stress I just haven't found the energy to cook my own food, you know? But now that things are changing, Fusion Fall Retro is out. I am super happy. 
Like everything that happened to me in the past year has just gone away. Love it. All right, let's eat this banana real quick. Shouldn't take too long. Potassium. Potassium, more like potassium. Yum. <laughs> oh yeah, I did. I played in early 2009. Background subscriptions were still a thing. I think it was like seven dollars a month actually some stupid price like 657 or some <laughs> something really ridiculous because it was made by korean devs wow this banana did not want to get unstuck to its bottom part You stole your mom's credit card to play. I can respect that. <laughs> well, this is an earlier build of the game, like right after they took away subscriptions. So really the only thing they've changed are adding a little bit of content and streamlining the future, which sucks because, like, we don't have many missions to play. Ah. All right, I'll be right back. I'm gonna throw away the banana peel. Huh. And I'm back. And back we go to farming. <laughs> Man, that banana was good. I love it when they're aged like just right, like a, like two two days after you get them. And they've got that like right mix of sweetness and banana taste. And they're not really crunchy and bitter, like when they're ripe or fresh from the store. Though the time you get to eat them when they're in that state. Yeah, kind of short. Cause like once they, once they like get too old, they get too soft and sweet. Like mushy. Hey. Oh. I love bananas. <laughs> They're my favorite fruit. Oh. I should eat more kinds of fruit though, other than just banana. I'm sure there are plums in there that I can snack on if I want. No, actually, I think when I end the stream, I'm going to eat, like, enchiladas or something. Right. Strawberries, huh? Yeah, only one person who kills Don Doom or Bad Max gets the thing. Because it's based on whoever gets the aggro first. So it's recommended to sit exactly on where he spawns. I'd like try and attack him first as well. Chipotle, huh? I've never had Chipotle. Is it good? Yeah, strawberries are pretty decent as well. I like them. They go good in some salads. I'll have to try Chipotle. 
It's like one of those things I hear so much about, but like I've never tried it. There are a lot of things like that that I haven't tried because I live in such a weird place in East Texas. Right, I'm just super glad we have an Arby's because that's like my favorite place ever. I'm pretty sure any amount of donations I got from the stream would go towards getting the Arby's roast beef and cheddar. <laughs> El Paso, Texas is. It's all the way to the left. Like right on uh, New Mexico or something. The original roast beef. The classic. Yeah. <laughs> I have to get the like the largest roast beef and cheddar they have because I swear they're making them smaller every time. Last time I got, last time I ate at Arby's, I ordered two roast beef and cheddars at like the most, the biggest size. I downed them in like 15 minutes. And I swear, I'm not like a big person. I'm just like really skinny and can eat a lot. I also had a bunch of cups of cheese and uh, some curly fries. You know, dipping, dipping those curly fries and cheese. That's, mm, that's the stuff. <laughs> Yeah. I've been eating roast beef and cheddar for such a long time. I think ever since I was like eight or something. I think you get at Arby's is chicken strip fries, cookies and cream shake. I, I definitely think you should try um, some of their sandwiches. Even the, well, if you if you've already tried the sandwiches and didn't like them, I can respect that. Cheers, mate. You right. Cheers, mate. A cookies and cream is a wonderful flavor. <laughs> what? See ya. Wow, it has been 2 hours and 45 minutes already. This game makes time pass by so fast. Hope everybody's been enjoying the stream. I've been providing excellent commentary of things like Arby's roast beef and cheddar. <laughs> Full of crates already. Getting about that time. I can almost sort of guess it now. When I'm gonna be full. Burger King Oreo Shake. E. That's odd. I remember I used to get Brahms like ice cream, like just like a bowl of vanilla ice cream from Brahms and like get their fries too, dip the fries in the ice cream. Hello. Bye. I eat at McDonald's a lot. I will usually get a Big Mac and some chicken nuggets and fries. Dude, look at all those super crates.
Did I just get a gumball from a super duper crate? That sucks. There's like a perfect Tetris piece of custard launchers. Prepare for transport. Breakfast. Yeah, they have pretty good pancakes. At least around here, anyway. Hit 75%. It's almost 3.30. I might go on a bit longer than I expected to get to 100k. Do I have Whataburger? Oh, heck yeah. We have like three in this one town. <laughs> Whataburger is delicious. I'll get like double bacon cheeseburgers and stuff from there. Ah, uh, that sucks. Back when I live in West Texas, the only restaurant we had near us was a Sonic. So of course I got addicted to their chili cheese fries. Ohio, huh? Is that place any nice? Or you worked at Sonic for a year? My friend has some pretty odd stories from Sonic. And how, like, their managers were, like, dealing drugs or something. It was really dumb. He, like, did not enjoy working at Sonic. Sonic and a Whataburger. Yeah. Cities usually have like every fast food chain. Some, like, take or give one, give or take one. Oh, that's awful. That's an awful thing for somebody to do. Locked up for a little while, huh? Yeah. Excuse me, Parks, huh? I don't go to those very often. He gains an In-N-Out almost all the time. I've had In-N-Out, I think, once. Or was it five? Yeah, I had five guys. Yeah, I haven't had In-N-Out. I need to try there. Chicken. You ever been to Schlitterbahn? I assume you meant to say you've never been to Schlitterbahn, or whatever German word that is. Twenty-eight 
20 minutes away. Oof. Back when I lived in West Texas, the only Arby's around was an hour away. But I somehow still got it, like, every time we went there. Best water ever. Oh, water park! Oh! I don't go to water parks. I can't swim, and I don't think I'll ever bother learning. I don't like being in water in general. Something about it just feels off to me. I don't think I can really enjoy being in water. Or swimming or anything like that. That's like the main reason I don't want to bother, you know? Like if I already don't enjoy something, why try to force myself to enjoy it, you know? That's why I don't get those acquired taste things either. Like, okay, you have to eat a lot of this thing that tastes like butt. What in the world, Astro? <laughs> that had best be a song. If it's a song, I'll let it through. Hey, gotta go. Ah, okay. Sorry about that. It's just uh, I have a pretty strong chat filter because this is this is still a kids game. But yeah, try and take it easy on like the over 13 content, you know? I'm not I'm not upset at you or anything, it's just, you know, kids game and all. <laughs> yeah. I'll have to look that song up though. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's weird. I have to work out in a couple of hours. I hope your workout goes well. Shift, shift eight, shift eight two. Oh yeah, that's weird. Maybe it's because like they didn't want they wanted people to be able to tell people to go away if they were being like harassed with normal messages, you know? Cause I know I got told to go away a bunch, especially when I was farming around Fuse. Cause I didn't have free chat. Ah, flat tires. Do you think we will keep our stuff when the game fully launches? Uh, I hope so. I really think, you know, we might. But, you know, they might have to do a database wipe if stuff goes wrong, you know? But I really do hope we're able to keep our stuff, you know? You know? If chat, you can't type anything at all. You have to have free chat on in your profile. This isn't CrossFit where you do a bunch of random stuff to activate your muscle confusion. <laughs> Statement. 
Those pants. Ah, oh, been going for three hours now. That's pretty much my average stream time, huh? Alright, guess I'll do one more inventory full of boxes and call it a night. Or a morning. Alrighty, thank you for stopping by tonight, Astro. I hope you have a nice night. And sleep well and all that stuff. Appreciate the follow, too, if you did. If you already followed, you might have followed during like my first stream, actually. When I streamed the tutorial back last year. Hey, Nightless Shadow, how are you doing? Thanks for stopping by last night. I mean, uh, tonight. <laughs> uh, I am currently trying to get 100,000 Taros. Did I do speedruns? I did a few. I did a few speedruns and got out of the map. Hey Shadow Gamer 315, thanks for stopping by tonight. Well, I guess it's technically the morning now. <laughs> yeah, thank you all for stopping by watching me. I appreciate that. Hey, good night, Astro. Yeah. How many do I have now? Around 80,000. Getting off of Fusion Fall for now? Yeah. This can get pretty boring, just the future by itself. I'm sure there are a bunch of people at Dawn Doom, like, sitting there <laughs> wishing groups were a thing. So I'm sure it's mostly just a place for people to hang out and chat by now, you know? Because I have been alone at Ghost Junkyard for the past three, two hours or so. Shooting for a couple of that, yeah. Uh, and no, I am not exactly worried for stuff, because if the database happens, or the database wipe happens, it happens. Like, there's no use getting upset over things that can't really be helped, you know? So I'm just getting up to 100,000 Taros just to say, hey, I grinded to 100,000 Taros, and <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm grinding for the heck of it. Plus, you know, you never know, I might find a bug that could be patched. <laughs> Since I am recording this. Heck yeah, bragging rights. Like the bragging rights of getting four pairs of Don Doom pants. Who's my favorite nano? That's... Courage. Courage is my favorite nano. Courage is like one of my favorite characters in this game too. You know he stops a meteor from falling into Earth. Like in game. Heck yeah, I brag about their items. I had like one of the biggest Ben 10 jacket collections <laughs> in the old game. I miss Courage saying soft shoe shimmy all the time. I can't wait till I get his nano again. Ah, uh, you know, honestly, I might stream for just about thirty more minutes or so before I get off. Hopefully, I can get a hundred k. If I'm really close when the 30 minutes are up, I'll probably stay up for a little bit longer. But usually when the sun starts to come up, I'll get really dead tired and want to go to sleep like a vampire. I need a coffin or something. <laughs> Grind it for days, yeah. I would do this forever. If if I had no need to eat, sleep, or drink, or no need to do anything else in the world we have today, I would probably just sit here grinding for the rest of time. Especially like especially since I have a chat to talk to, you know? 
Alrighty, Aquafina. I hope you had fun with those games. Thanks for stopping by. What? Wait, are you gonna actually? You still <laughs> grindmaster? Axel, hell yeah. I mean, heck yeah. The I mean, if you're still gonna stop by and watch my stream, I appreciate that a lot. But I can understand if you wanna, you know, get out, talk with your friends, and I'll have my stream on in the background, you know. But anyway, thank you for watching so far. I appreciate that. If only grinding was really fun. Who knows, maybe it'll be really fun in Legacy. Night, Aquafina. Thank you for stopping by all that good stuff. Honestly, it's like, it's in the same vein as one of my Dream Team Nanos. Courage and two other Nanos that aren't Adaptium. Like Heal. Drain and like some other combat nano for grinding, you know? But uh, I think grinding and stuff is in the same vein as like speedrunning, only like a little more repetitive. Like in speedrunning, at least, you get to refine your craft until you're like some of the best of the best at this one particular thing, which I'm planning to do with races. But for now, I've just been grinding. Because, you know, why not? 100,000 nanos. Arrows. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, I'm sure people will speedrun the races when they come out, absolutely. Like, people speedran the tutorial for a while when it came out. Though Devin already made a task of it, so... <laughs> Not much to be speedrun anymore. I'm sure people will speedrun the entire game, too. Like all the nanos. Yeah, speedrunners are pretty crazy. But I gotta say, though, I did grind Grandmaster in Heroes of the Storm, and that's arguably even worse than speedrunning. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I want to speedrun the race areas. Well, I, I mean, I'm definitely going to try and speedrun the race areas, but... Yeah, I'll definitely speedrun Fusion Vol, especially all the race areas and stuff. Like, I managed to grind to Grandmaster in Heroes of the Storm, where every game was the same five people. <laughs> or the same ten people. So I bet I can speedrun. It'll be especially gratifying if I can get, like, the top scores and everything, you know? Oh, inventory's full again. Alright. So I think I'll... Yeah, bragging rights. Heck yeah. Walk up to Prizzy and be like, Hey, I am the best racer in Fusion Fall. Aha! Have some bits. <laughs> but anyway... Grandmaster Grinder Racer. Perfect titles. Master of Fusion Fall. I think that title belongs to Devin. But anyway, here at about 4, if I'm not super close to hitting 100k, I'll go ahead and call it a night. Nice Morning. Ah, need to open the crates first. Wow, I got a bunch of silver here. Booty crates. Butt crates. I can dethrone him. Just grind harder. Maybe. I, I mean, I can try. Maybe I'll post, like, the, hundred, the, the picture of the 100,000 Taros in the Discord, and it'll post, like, some eyes or something. And back to the grind we go. <laughs> I have money. Pay attention to me. I'm pretty sure Prizzy only pays attention to me because I threw I've thrown like twenty dollars worth of ad bits at him. <laughs> uh
got my blue boots, green pants, green shirt, green gun, green head, green beanie, green. Everybody he knows and himself is green. Yeah, anybody with GM in their name is a is an indeed a developer. Or game master, I guess. Did I ever get the angel wings or the devil wings? I've gotten both. I had the devil wings on for a while, but I got tired of how edgy they were, so I eventually just settled down with the putta. So my set for my popping in and out with the Dexter weapon. <laughs> yeah, he likes to watch people like a weirdo. I know Zenpok is mean. He'll spawn fusion spawns on you and kill you. <laughs> but anyway, my set for my um for my level 36 character when I played a while ago was a Ben 10 jacket, put a uh, cannonbolt leggings and some xenon boots or whatever they were. Don't tell him I said he's weird. He will kill me. Because it's like an ultra rare item and it, like highly desired and stuff. Oh no. <laughs> the secret's up. I'm going to die. Here in a bit there's going to be 17 Dawn Dooms attacking me. My hard-earned money. Yeah, most of the game masters and community team are playing this game constantly. It would be hard not to see them, especially Devin, since he's in a full ass, a full on cannon bolt set. Making out noises every now and then. Spooky right. Devin. Have you seen uh, Prezi riding his invisible hoverboard? That is also sideways. <laughs> That's amazing. Yeah, he's got a hoverboard. Devin, uh, Tech the Noob, and Prizzy all have like uh, cars and stuff they can ride around on. So, fun fact about my keyboard every key on the left side of it is completely worn out. Like, there is no more paint on it. It is just the LEDs. They look like smiley faces. Honestly, they look more like hammers than smiley faces, now that I look at them. They look like little Thor hammers. Hey, gotta go. 
Maybe I'll post a picture in my Discord one of these days. How do I grind for this long and not get burned out? I turn off my brain. <laughs> I'm basically not looking at Fusion Fall right now. I'm looking directly at my chat and focusing on other things in the room. Do I think people will be shocked? They can try, but uh, Devin, he'll put a stop to that. I'm, I'm sure. This Devin was the hackiest hacker in old Fusion Fall. Like, I have complete faith in our developers to, that they will, like, completely put a stop to all sorts of cheating and stuff. Because, like, I heard earlier in, in the stream or so, in one of Prizzy streams, that they have a speed check in, in place. Using his powers for good. Heck yeah, they have a speed check in place, I'm sure, for, like, attack speed and movement speed. So if you go over this, I'm pretty sure you will get kicked. There's also a thing where it will detect, like, irregular packets as well. And it'll kick you for that, too. Which is wonderful. I'm sure there will be a lot of attempts, but this has gone incredibly smooth for like a, a relaunch and stuff. Like they've said it many times, like how everybody, everything else that's been relaunched has been DDoS. This hasn't been. I love this song. Inventory's full. Heard the noise. Well, it's not like people can hack in items. Or Taro's anymore, especially. Because, like, everything that could have been hacked in the old game... Who watches the Watchers? I just got an achievement. Wait! That I think that means I got Affiliate! <laughs> Heck yeah! Oh my goodness. Okay, I, w I was gonna say, if there has been a hack that's been hacked in the old game, Devin has done it. So, he is probably fully aware of every kind of hack in Fusion Fall, and he will probably put a stop to it. Or he will definitely put a stop to it. <laughs> like, I, I, have a, I have complete faith in this game's anti-cheat. Holy crap, look at all those chests of the same color. Oddly enough, I think the chests that net me the most money are the <laughs> the, the base ones. Very nice weather we are having. Do you agree with the statement? How do I open the crates instantly? I right click. I also sell by right clicking. Good night, OCEC. Thank you so much for stopping by. I hope you have a good sleep and all that stuff. <laughs> yeah, good morning. Might as well be morning, too. <laughs> but anyway, thank you for stopping by tonight. I appreciate all the support and the follows. Thank you all. Alright, I think I'll do one more full inventory of crates and call it a night. Morning. It's in the morning. <laughs> Fusion matter. Oh, I see a person. I see people. Xavier Crimson Ranger. Well, you shouldn't be surprised that I'm grinding because I'm doing it for the heck of it. Don't worry about me. But yeah, other people, that is kind of surprising. They might have the same motive as me, though. Everybody's different, but sometimes we have the same qualities.
90,000. 90%. I don't think I'm gonna get the 100k tonight, though, sadly. But still, 90,000 in about three hours? That's really good. Especially since we're only killing level 4 mobs. <laughs> if I had been grinding, like, level 36 mobs, I'm sure I would have gotten, like, so much more Taros. I miss Cheese. Cheese was a good character. I hope I get to see him again. See any world region players? Uh, I don't think I've seen anybody from, you know, other than the US or anybody that didn't know English that well, you know? Most of the time, I've just been sitting here in Ghost Junkyard farming these guys. I've been stunned. That is a rarity. Yeah, I'm glad people from other countries are playing this game. That's pretty nice. I think Billy and Mandy was popular in Japan for some reason. I mean, sometimes I'll go hang out with some streamers like Brizzy or Magical Dealer, but that's pretty much it. <laughs> Just grind. Hey. Maybe I could get to 120,000 and just like buy a hundred eggs, super duper eggs, and, <laughs> and mess around with that. Grind! <laughs> That's pretty much me. One of my friends worry, was worried that Fusion Fall would kidnap me. I mean, it has. <laughs> He's lost me to Fusion Fall forever. At least until Friday. <laughs> Actually, maybe they might keep it open. Who knows? The world is a mystery. Pretty much not everything is set in stone. You see that sick parkour action that I jumped off that car? Fusion Fall Forever. That's gonna be the third game in the trilogy. Fusion Fall Retro Legacy and Forever! Attorney. Okay. Yeah, probably wants this girl probably wants to kill some. Let's go over to this spot. I haven't been here in a hot minute. Three hours. <laughs> Yeah, this is actually just what I've been doing all stream. Not since day one, though. I've been hanging out at Dawn Doom, spots like that, hanging out with the community and stuff. It's just today I've been doing this for pretty much all day, all night, all morning. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, I have, ground I have grinded for a very, very long time in this game so far. And I'll be honest, I wouldn't be surprised if I had been the most grindy player in this game. Grind Master Axel. So, um... The thing, of it, the thing is, though, why I don't stream for very long is because I don't like streaming while there are other people. Like Prissy or Tech the Noob or Magical Dealer are streaming. Because I wouldn't want to step on any toes, you know? Like, it's it's their game, they were working on it. I don't want to snatch any viewers from them, you know? They deserve all the recognition and fame they can get. Praise. Especially with Mayhem. 
Like I'm just the, I'm just some guy sitting here playing the, the game and doing the same thing over and over for hours a time. Yeah, I'm pretty much confined to Twitch. I do not want to stream on YouTube. I think Twitch might be the lesser of the two evils, if that's a way to say it. But the thing is, I don't want to I don't want to stream on anything but Twitch because I've already have I've already set up so much stuff to Twitch, you know. I don't plan on being any some sort of controversial rule breaker or anything like that. I will definitely abide by the rules, definitely. Oh, great tool. Alright, this is the last this is the last run I'm doing. I may have broken one rule back a long, long time ago, 2016, by accident. And I apologize deeply from the bottom of my heart. It will never ever happen again. One of my friends said a bad word. No, nah, I was one of my friends. I immediately cut the stream off and deleted the VOD. <laughs> I was so- I was panicking so hard. Like, I had just made my Twitch, I just followed like a hundred people, I didn't want it to get it banned. Tiberius Rose. Tiberius Rose. A really cool name. Alright, let's see what we got. Will time travel save the world? It already has! That's the wonderful thing of time travel. It also has an infinite amount of times. It has an infinite amount of times. See, I'm a fan of multiverse theory. <laughs> All right, well, it has been, multiverse doesn't exist, <laughs> it also does exist, <laughs> it's, it's impossible to know, but anyway, I think I'm gonna go ahead and call it quits for this morning, I have to go spend some time with my mom when she gets off of work, you know, 12 hour night shift, all that stuff, but um, thank you all so much for joining me this early morning, late night, watching all that good stuff. I hope you all have wonderful nights. I will. I'll take it easy. I hope everybody else takes it easy, too. Uh, goodbye. Have a nice night.